Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. Uh, this is the continuity of the series of my videos about the symptoms. And today's symptom is, uh, uh, I'm going to tell you about uh, the breast lump. So what is breast lump? And if you have the uh, breast lump, then what are the possible causes? Uh, the first of all, we will uh, talk about what is uh, breast lump, you know. You know, if uh, the breast lump is a growth, uh, in fact, the tissues, uh, they grow uh, within the breast. And there are different uh, types of the lumps that uh, they are different in feel and uh, look as well. So, which means it may be mass, it may be growth, it may be you will feel like any swelling in uh, the area, maybe you will feel a thickness in the breast area, or maybe you will feel kind of uh, uh, fullness in the breast. And uh, you may, the other uh, things that you may feel if you have any lump in the breast, uh, breast will be like uh, you feel that uh, slightly uh, is a thickened area which is slightly more uh, prominent in the breast. And uh, it's a di it looks different from the surrounding tissues. You know. uh, another thing is uh, uh, the one breast looks uh, is larger than the other one. And if the nipples are inverted, uh, inside or maybe uh, you have uh, a redness in the breast uh, uh, which is uh, painful uh, and maybe discharge from the breast or maybe a firm and hard area within the breast tissue and uh, uh, maybe a mass which has a kind of clear borders so if you f if you have any uh, type of uh, the mass like this you know or any problem like this uh, it's known as uh, the lump uh, it's not uh, serious all the time but sometimes uh, it may be a sign of breast cancer so this is the reason that if you see any lump, any discharge, or any abnormality or any change in the breast, you know, like it may be redness or maybe any mass, any growth, any uh, irregular or hard uh, thing, you know. So you should always uh, uh, see your doctor for scanning, for the breast scanning. Uh, most of the time the lumps are non-cancerous, but there's no harm to find out uh, what is the underlying cause for uh, this, you know. The next thing is we will talk about uh, if you have the breast lump then what are the possible causes well the possible cause it may be due to lipoma and which means that uh, it's a uh, it's like doughy kind of uh, growth uh, which is uh, most of the time it is harmless so no need to worry and other cause uh, which may be like uh, introductal papilloma which means is a benign growth uh, in the milk ducts, you know. And uh, fibrocystic fib uh, uh, breast, another cause for the lung, you know, it's a rope-like breast tissue, mostly it's benign. And fibroadenoma, uh, a benign mass, especially it's in the young woman. Uh, breast cancer, uh, mastitis means an infection of the breast tissues and mostly it uh, happens uh, in the women who are breastfeeding and uh, maybe the uh, like uh, milk cyst is another cause for the lump uh, which means that uh, there's a lot of milk in the uh, milk ducts you know. So these are the possible causes, but if you have uh, any like uh, that mass, I, uh, as I, uh, you can see in the pictures, you know, so the next thing uh, is uh, that if you have the lump in the breast, then what should you do? Well, there are certain things. If there is a discharge coming out from this or if there is uh, uh, any kind of uh, 
uh, growth it's hard uh, or uh, if uh, uh, the nipples are inverted inside uh, or there is a your if you feel that your uh, one breast is getting larger than the other one uh, if there is any kind of redness uh, you should consult your doctor for further evaluation uh, thank you very much bye